Clark. This is Clark Spinoza, and you're watching Behind the Cape. What's going on, Toronto fans? I'm Ben Pearson, and welcome to the first edition of Behind the Cape, featuring the men's tennis team. The squad's off to a fast start so far, with senior Clark Spinoza winning the Harvard Chowderfest two weekends ago. And this past weekend, Euros Petro Nivic went undefeated in singles on his way to winning the Napa Valley Classic wildcard shootout. It was, uh, it was a great weekend for me. Both me and Clark played uh, really well on, on this tournament. Clark had a really, really tough group. Um, but eventually I got a, I re revenged him. Watching Uki win the wild card shootout was, I mean, it was awesome. It was uh, 10 point breakers in the end and he really took it to every guy out there and he saved a bunch of match points in the first match and he got me, uh, he got some revenge for me against a 10 point breaker from the guy from A&M. So that was great to see. And it's just a, it's a, just a great experience for him is winning his first collegiate tournament and uh, hopefully he can ride that wave into all Americans. He just played really solid and kind of used that momentum from saving those match points in the in the first uh, match that he did, the ten point tiebreaker that he did, and carried it over to the semi in the final. Clark Euros and Roma Collegian will be back in action this weekend when they travel to Tulsa, Oklahoma, to compete in the ITA All American Championships. Me and Uki and the guys that have been traveling for three weeks in a row. We don't really have a social life right now. It's just basically catching up on school and. Uh, dealing with Coach Macy out here on the tennis courts? Well, I mean, the last two tournaments we've, we've come out of and the guys have done really well. They've, you know, Clark was the MVP of the Boston tournament and then this last week Euros won this tournament up in Napa. You know, I, I just hope that they just, the big goal of the summer, or big goal of the summer, big goal of the, uh, of the fall is to keep improving and getting better. And, you know, I don't want them to get ahead of themselves and try to get wins. It's more of, you know, you go out and you play well, the results will show up for themselves. And, you know, they all have a great opportunity in the fact that they're in the qualifying or the main draw. And there's great players throughout the country. And so each one of them are going to get an opportunity to play against some guys that are play high on their team and get good ranked wins to see if they can get a chance to get into the NCAA tournament later on in the spring.